If we liken a country to a towering tree, what are its roots and what keeps it standing tall? 2,000 years ago, ancient Chinese people provided an answer. The ancient Changshu, one of China's earliest compilations of historical documents, contains a saying. The people are the foundation of a state, and only when the foundation is strong can the state be secure. In the Palace Museum in Beijing, an exquisite jade artifact from the Qing Dynasty is showcased. It portrays a group of people working on reshaping the landscape and diverting the water. This is the story of Yu the Great, the hero who wisely tamed the Yellow River flood in ancient China. The story tells how Yu, as a leader in flood control, worked tirelessly for the well-being of all, undertaking the arduous task with indomitable resolve. The idea of the people being the foundation of a state still impacts us today. The Communist Party of China, by placing the people at the center, not only carries forward the ancient concept of people-oriented governance, but also expands upon it. In over 70 years of governance, the CPC has managed to feed nearly 20% of the world's population. And that's with less than 9% of the world's arable land. The party has helped around 800 million people leave absolute poverty behind. Once impoverished and backward, China has risen to be the second largest economy in the world and has remained in that position firmly for over the past decade. In China, the average life expectancy of its citizens has reached 78.2 years, and the country has established the world's largest education system, social security system, and health care system, with over 1 billion people connected to the Internet. The CPC strives to bring the Chinese people a better life, thus driving the nation's development. These trees grew from saplings planted by Chinese leaders several years ago. It's a tradition for them to plant trees with ordinary citizens every spring. This activity is meant to send a message of green development to the public. Yet, the tradition offers profound insight Governing a country is like planting a tree. Only with a strong foundation can it thrive. 